Hey guys, so today I have another empties for you. Um, and my face looks different. I'm only wearing powder foundation because I just wasn't feeling like a regular full face today. And um, yeah, and my nails aren't done either. So they look terrible. But whatever. This is just an empties video. It's okay. So we're just gonna dive right in. And sorry, I don't know why I sound so sniffly all of a sudden. I really hope I'm not getting sick. I usually only get sniffly at work because of all the like clothes and everything. Okay. I'll let off sneeze again. Okay. Anyway, we're just gonna dive right into the empties. First of all, I have a couple of hairsprays. Um, I of course used up two bottles of the Not Your Mother She's a Teeds Volumizing Hairspray. It's my favorite. Ooh. I got it at Ulta for $5.99 and then buy one get one half off or if it's not on sale there sometimes I'll go to Walmart because it's like $4.70 something at Walmart so it's a little bit cheaper and then um, the got to be guardian angel humidity defense I use like a little bit of this first and then that hairspray this one kind of like smooths and helps control frizz um, but although when it gets really humid my hair still like just does what it wants to um so yeah but it does help a little bit to control the frizz and then I used up the um smooth no straight sexy hair um smooth and seal anti frizz and shine spray this is one I got last year and I just had a little bit left um that I was kind of hoarding and using only on super humid days but now I have a new one that thing is called smooth sexy hair but yeah, I did like that and it helped a little bit. Then I have Clear Care Triple Action Cleaning 3% Hydrogen Peroxide Contact Solution. Um, I went back to this because it helps my contacts last longer. I wear two week lenses, but with this I can get like three or four weeks out of a pair. Um, without them getting like super blurry and bothering my eyes or anything. Um, I think I like get hairspray in my contacts. That probably isn't the best. But this cleans them super well. And I can, yeah, get more use out of my contacts. So I like that. And then I have Soap and Glory the Righteous Butter. I love the smell of this. But I probably won't repurchase because it does have parabens. Which I really don't like. It has like at least three no four yeah it has four parabens so I mean really what's the what's the point of that I just I don't get it so I love the smell of um soap and glory's classic scent it just smells so good but again four parabens really no um then Bosha Tsubaki cleansing oil gel I did like this but um, I probably wouldn't repurchase. I'm trying to just use cheaper stuff to remove my makeup because, um, you know, it's just one of those things. Don't really have to spend a lot. I did like it, but again, I don't know if I'll repurchase. Then I used up the Dr. Woods Pure Tea Tree Cast Oil Soap with Shea Butter. I used this to wash my beauty blender. When I ordered this online, like I thought it was gonna be a bigger bottle, so but it was really cheap, so I don't know. I, I usually use Dr. Bronner's soap that comes in a huge bottle, so yeah, it worked. But I like the regular Dr. Bronner's better. Um, then I used Up and Up baby wipes. I keep these in the drawer here to wipe off my fingers and stuff while I'm doing makeup, so I did repurchase those. Then, whoa, I used a Mario Badescu whitening mask, and this is just a white mask. Um, there is some kind of like around the edges, but it's just so dried up, I can't really get it out. And this has a nice kind of like kind of fruit scent to it. And I did like this. Um, it's supposed to help lighten hyperpigmentation and acne scarring help calm and flame skin um, I think I did notice a difference when I was using this regularly 
but it is around twenty dollars for only like two ounces so right now i'm using a mask by the body shop that i got recently so i did like this but i wouldn't repurchase unless probably i had like a coupon or something then i have the shea terra organics rose hips black soap like i mentioned before i went back to this and i've been using this almost every night so i did repurchase that and i have been loving it and then i used up a mini size of the bare minerals purifying facial cleanser i was using this in the shower as my just gentle morning cleanser i did really like this um i would actually consider getting it but probably only if i got a really good deal on it like i did with this this came in a tiny little set from the Bare Minerals outlet that had the eye cream, which I am using, and um, what else did I have? Had this, and then, oh, a little mini, um, <clears throat> it also had a little mini purifying, nourishing moisturizer, but I think out of the set, my favorite thing probably was this cleanser, so I just really like it. I used a sample of the Fresh black tea aged late eye concentrate which I was really excited about this sample because obviously it's an eye cream so it lasted me a while and um it's a really nice size sample and this stuff is really expensive so I probably wouldn't buy it but I mean I did really enjoy using the sample so that was nice and then my husband used up I wanted to show these because in, in case the guy in your life um my husband really liked these, the Old Spice Pure Sport High Endurance Antiperspirant and Deodorant, and then the mini size of Old Spice Fiji, which I actually had bought this to try for myself because I'd heard a lot of women liked using this because it worked better than a women's deodorant. And um, yeah, but for me, like, I didn't feel like it worked any better for me and I just felt like I smelled like a guy so I only used it like twice and then gave it to my husband so and he liked it so yeah he did really like these Old Spice deodorants and my husband like hardly ever goes through anything seriously I mean obviously he uses you know deodorant and all that every day but um I seriously think he must use like a pea size amount of shampoo and stuff because literally he will take like a year to go through a bottle of shampoo and that time I'll go through like several liters each of shampoo and conditioner which obviously I have a lot more hair than him but still he he's you know he's good at making stuff last so hey I guess that's good but anyway so that is it for my empties. I hope you enjoyed and again, I hope you don't mind my not done nails. I hate not having my nails done. I'm going to go do them right after this, but I needed to go ahead and get this done. I was doing stuff around the house and so now it's like 7 o'clock at night and um, yeah, so yeah. How do I have good hair days when I'm not going anywhere? Seriously. I always have the worst hair days like on Sundays for church. Like pretty much always. Yeah, that's not fair. Life isn't fair. Nope, that's what I've decided. As if we all didn't know, life's not fair. Because of bad hair days. <laughs> okay. So I hope you enjoyed this empties video and be sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Follow me on Pinterest, Instagram, um, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. So I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Okay, here we go.